Hey friends, so welcome to Las Giddy. Another Dutchy December. I go by Yabby Yab. If you have not been subscribed yet, don't forget to subscribe. Click the red button below. And if you see my face, thanks for coming back. Anyways, I'm in Lagos. Guess who I'm with? <laughs> ah, my cousin Osai. <laughs> hey, listen. The last December we spent was 2018, but I didn't record. I didn't. I wasn't vlogging at that time. No. And I bought my camera. You can even remember I, I bought my camera, but mm -hmm. I just didn't turn my camera on. But this time I'm gonna vlog, so you guys are gonna see. It's gonna be a lot of. Fun. Today is actually Christmas, you guys. So Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. And uh, we're going to like a family gathering, get together, and I'm just wearing this. Let me give you guys a little OTD. The lighting in this room is not the best. Yeah, laying in this room is not the best. But I'm just wearing all black today. I should have been in a Christmas spirit. I'll say he has um, a burgundy two-piece set. So yes, yeah, so I'm just wearing this like black jeans, black top. And I just, I'm just i gonna wear a brown bag just cause I don't wanna wear my black bag and have everything all black. So I'm wearing a brown bag. We gotta figure out the lighting in this room cause it's kind of trash. But yeah. Yeah, I don't think so. Mm. Okay, well, the bathroom is okay. Actually, oh yeah, the bathroom's okay. But yeah, so I'll catch you guys later in the day. Um, I'm gonna have to be adjusting my holiday. So, season. All right, so after stopping by Family House, we went to Hard Rock just for casual drinks. Then we went to W Bar, which is actually one of my favorite bars, lounges in Lagos. And then we went to Quilux. You know, you can't come to Lagos and go to one spot in one night. <laughs> and this was me running off with no sleep. <laughs> he was straight from the airport. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Legos has won us yesterday. Like yeah, he's already wanting me today. <laughs> She's already tired. She's I need a Red Bull. She's sleeping and we haven't even gone out That's yet. That's the first thing yeah. I'm going to ask for a Red Bull. She didn't come for Dancing <laughs> December. You just came for I her. tried, but is like the December was dead to me now. No, seriously, Lagos is winning. Like, yesterday, I didn't even record like that, but we went to um, oh, we went to Hard Rock first, just for, like casual drinks and stuff. Then we went. Where did we go after Hard Rock? We went to W. Oh yeah, we went to W Bar for a quick. It was a quick pit stop. I even kind of forgot. Now Hi, guys, was lit. It's me from yesterday. Yes, I just yeah, got a know. bob. You know, you know, <laughs> yeah, you, can, you cannot come to and the, the, bo the bob is bobbing. And the Bodzi is Bodzi, okay? The Bodzi. Woo! Osei doesn't understand. Like, <laughs> this is a natural, you guys. Like, completely natural. Oh, I got this. I just got all black. I ain't wearing nothing special. I'm just wearing a little black leather. Blacked out. But she's a whole f***ing bob. That's why you did. That's why she didn't record, because she was too busy. <laughs> <laughs> day two and like we haven't even reached a whole week yet but now so we're about to go to um this uh thing at hard rock again it's called obese i believe it's called we requested our boats yeah. yeah we even thought we we're gonna wake up to like get food go to a restaurant but that was just we're just lying to ourselves like literally that's what we're doing no we, we could do it no we have to do it like we this week yeah, we, we gotta go to that restaurant, the cave restaurant. I forgot the name. A lot of yeah, we have to. But I guess it's just because Christmas and Boxing Day is today, so we kind of like just want to go out nightlife. Yeah, like, we need to sleep. Yeah, but then throughout the week, we'll definitely go to restaurants. But yeah, I'll catch you guys later. If I record tonight, I hope for everyone will know. Toodles. Christmas is truly the most wonderful time of the year. All the lights, the decor, the ambiance, everybody's just jolly. Ugh, I love Christmas. So we ended up going to Obi's house, which happens every Monday at Hard Rock Cafe. It's like the place to go 
on a Monday. Was he stressing me? You call it Stephanie? Piano, 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 piano. <laughs> that night was lit. After we went to Prime Chinese, because you know, gotta get food after you leave, you know. The food was good here, so definitely check it out. It's a nice little spot. Back in the hotel, got in like around six something, and we went to Prime Lagos to get some food. I got some takeaway. I ate um, the rice and the meat. At the restaurant, I had to take away five noodles with uh, chicken shrimp. Had an early night in, early meaning like 6.30. <laughs> but you know, I'm so jet lagged. So my like body stopped operating off of um, American time. None of this. But I don't even know if there's any point to sleep because I have to check out this hotel by 12 noon and it's already about to be 8 a.m. And I have to get unready. So I'm about to like, push you guys right here. But yeah, we just went to Hard Rock. Child. Don't break, baby. We just went to Hard Rock. And then we went to Prime Restaurant. And um, we're going to go to another hotel. We're in the BI, but we're going to go to a hotel in Lecky. So yeah, today was pretty, pretty chill. But it was super, like, super fun. It was fun, it was fun, it was fun. It was fun. But yeah, I'm about to change and just lay in the bed because I'm probably not going to sleep, honestly. I'm not going to lie to myself, but I'll just say goodnight to the camera. Yeah. Alright, about to unready myself. Um, I'm going to wipes, take my contacts out, hop in the shower, do a little quick rinse, and go to bed. checked out of our hotel we tried to get a hotel in lucky we didn't really like it so we ended up coming back to our hotel in vi which makes more sense because pretty much everything is in vi and this hotel is just comfy cozy and just more homey so yeah back at square one hola this room probably looks familiar because we're back at square one we checked back into the Victoria Crown Plaza Hotel back in VI. Funny story, we weren't really liking that hotel and we just made like a decision to just go back to this one because this one is just more cozy, more comfy, and just more welcoming. But I'm gonna give you guys a quick room tour while the room is still looking presentable. <laughs> this is the room. I put all the suitcases stuffed over there. So, yeah, here's our bed. We got the deluxe king size bed. I love the paintings on the wall. A little, like, I would, well, the other people would call this an office space. I would call it a little vanity for our makeup. Um, and then we have the couch here. The room is so big. We got the road, the madness of. Lagos track. Well, it's actually not traffic right now, but nice other painting here. A little seating area. All our guests usually just sit on the couch. Um, then we have the fridge. This fridge, cute, right? Cozy, super super cozy. Better than the other hotel. Here you got me. This is literally my favorite errand running dress. So this is like what I wear whenever I want to run an errand or if I need to just like go somewhere really quick, pop this on. All our load is over here for now. This is our 
closet space. Cause yeah, I just realized when I first came into Nigeria, I did not show you guys the hotel. So I was like, let me show you guys in case you guys come and you guys wanna stay here. This is the bathroom. I love the marble. Love, love, love. Sink. Got your little. You got your mirror. I got the, the huge, the magnifying mirror in here. All right, so we got that over here. Got your main mirror, a sink, a water they provide you with. I don't brush my teeth with the tap water. Um, I usually brush it with bottled water. Shower. It's a tub, well, shower tub. And then that's pretty much it. I'm gonna try to try to unpack. So, oh, this is the room just from like this angle. Yeah. Super cozy. So, I'm gonna try to like unpack a few of my stuff because I don't know. I have this habit of not unpacking and I'm staying for a while. We're staying, we're staying in this hotel. It seems confusing because we were in this hotel before when I first landed into Nigeria. Then we checked out into another hotel and we came back here because we're just like, this is way better. It's more cozy, welcoming, more comforting. So we came back to Victoria Crown Plaza Hotel. Um, the nightly rate, I don't know, but if you guys see like in the description, I'm gonna like link all the places I've stayed and things that I did while I'm in Nigeria. So if you guys wanna come to Nigeria, you guys wanna do some of the things or stay in the places that I stayed in. But um, yeah, this hotel is just way more, my hand hurts. <laughs> this hotel is just way more cozy. But yeah. Oh, I need to put this on. Okay. Let me pop a little seat. But yeah. So, yeah, better. Here we go. Um, I realized that I haven't stayed put for more than four hours. Like, I haven't laid on the bed for more than four hours. So, yesterday was definitely a rest day because we needed that. As soon as I came home from the airport, it was just go mode. Like, go, 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 go. So, I felt like my body was low-key shutting down. <laughs> so... Um, and I'm feeling under the, under the weather, and Hamilton is not helping. Hamilton, for those of you guys who don't know, it's like their winter here. So it's more so like colder to them and like to people that live in Nigeria. But for us, cold. Ugh, it's nothing. But you know, for them, it's colder and it's dusty. And my body does not do well with dust at all. But yeah, I'm gonna get some rest. I'm not gonna sleep, but I'm just gonna lay down and just catch up on some emails and all that stuff. I'm gonna catch you guys when I'm getting ready for dinner. All right, all ready for a late dinner. Even though we're supposed to leave for our dinner since like, what, seven o'clock? What time? What's like, seven o'clock. Yeah, and what time is it now? Nine thirty-two. Wow. <laughs> but I took a really nice nap when I got back from, when I had finished eating the pasta. And, um, oh guys, by the way, a fan is essential in this latest. My fan doesn't work. I don't know if it's working. Your fan is so much better. Look at her fan, you guys. Her fan is like... Her fan is like a fan fan. And it has the levels to show you how... I need to get this. You gotta send me the Amazon link. Wow, this is really good. This is what saved me the other day when I wore the black outfit. This is what saved me. But yeah, we're about to go to Kingfish. Me, Osei, and Ola. It's gonna be a vibe. Osei looks gorgeous as usual. Oh, you didn't know I was vlogging? <laughs> yeah, she looks gorgeous as Hi. usual. Hi. So cute. Mmm, Botsy. This is natural, you guys. <laughs> but yeah, and I'm just wearing like a black. I'm pretty simple today. Nothing too special. Wearing like a black and some pants. But yeah, this is the look. Nice little outing with the girls. We went to Kingfisher, which is an over the water restaurant. It's casual, chill, and cute.
Outside, freshen up, and we're gonna go back outside again because we're outsiders. Are you an outsider? <laughs> no, we just went inside to freshen up, and we're back out. We're headed to Buzz Bar because Buzz Bar is the place to go when there's nowhere to go. Wait, what happened? I got the chicken show on. No, I said let me get a chicken. Oh, is it ready? Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. You can't say you went to Nigeria and you did not try road tattoo, yeah. This is one of my spots, but I have a few other spots that have some good roadside suya. This one is Norma. This is like my go-to. It's on Admiralty Way in Lekki. So you definitely gotta try it out and try the shawarma. It's good too. Real authentic Nigerian street food. Yes. <laughs> Am I lying? Everything out there, you see? That one is sincerely out there. I haven't heard the a boat asking how much is the trip. I haven't heard that one yet. How much did how much did I have to tell you? Ah, no, 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 no. Ah, to go up there, there. Every time, say, ah, no, 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 no. Every time they ask you where you going, I hate it so much. Cause it's like, why do you want to know where I'm going? They just want to see, oh, the distance, how much they're making. Uh, that's how I learned. Since the, the road is not good. Let me tell you something. That's how I learned. Like, like first step. Oh yeah, first step road isn't good. No, you guys. Let me tell you something. No, this country is the most. It's the country where you see the most. How can I say? Bougiest drivers in the world. <laughs> Yo, it will be like Oh, you should have seen it earlier. Me and Osai were like trying to go to the other hotel. The guy said, ah, my mother can't take this luggage. <laughs> Just because. But you had a Toyota. No, I'm like. He was like, he was like, I can't tear up my, I'm the, um, I'm okay. just going to tear up my chair. <laughs> I said, but so you can tell me to do Uber with your car. Exactly. And on top of that, you're driving a, uh, what? A Toyota. Corolla. I said, I even put luggages in my car and it's a bend. Like, what are you talking about? Yeah, nah. Let me tell you, you'll have drivers that say something like, this is lucky, right? Where are you going? I just, ah, I can't go to I just, too much traffic. <laughs> I got no, 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 please, cancel, 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 I won't go to that. Look, where are you going? I'm going to Ikoi. Ah, the traffic on the lake bridge. I cannot do it. I cannot. Just cancel. You'll be like, bro, I'm still on the island. I'm not telling you I'm going to mainland. I'm not telling you I'm traveling to another state. I am literally going. From here, yeah, to here. Yes, ah, no, no, no. The guest traffic is. All right, we're back in. And we came in kind of early today. We got our shawarma from Normal. No, Normal, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> normal Ola. Hey, girl. Hey. She got shawarma and suya, so. Yes, I did. Yes, yeah. I did. So we got to grab a tap Yeah. I think we're going to go to the beach tomorrow because I want a beach day. It'll be super cute. But yeah, we're about to get on the ready. Well, I'm gonna eat this food first. Oh yeah, let me let me put this camera on me. Let me take a little bite. Take a little bite. They're showing my rocking, by the way. Another place in Onimu. Fire. What is it called? I don't remember, but it's outside of the, um, the Ebenon in Onimu. Mm, that's my little spot. Like I'm telling you, that's my spot. Oh, she's not gonna do things like tea, tea, those are tea something. You record him? Mm -hmm. Hey, blog. Oh, okay. You like it? You like the song? Mm hmm. Okay, okay. I didn't do bad. I didn't do bad. Mm. Mm. That, that merch, Mr. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Sorry. 
The American Chihuahua was too white. It was too white. What you mean white? Like, the, like you see how this is like pink. The sauce. Yeah. With the sauce and with the sauce they put in there. Yeah, but the Marquee one was white, white. Yeah, like it wasn't. Was no. Like, yeah, it they wasn't. Put the sauce. They put that um, like mayonnaise sauce in there. But mm. it's supposed to be mayonnaise with pepper mm -hmm. mixed together to make it like a red or a pink. Like this. It was good to me, but it had my ass on the toilet, but it was good. Good bad. Good morning, guys. Ooh, I'm some tan because I'm sweated up. Well, good afternoon. I finally woke up before sunset. I'm going to Good Beach. I'm going to meet up with Ola and her cousins because I have not done a day activity. So I said, oh, maybe it's a good idea for me to request my boat as I'm doing all this but I, mean, I haven't done a day activity so i was just like you know what oh uh, the good beach okay oh wow they're like two minutes okay i'll request when i'm like doing my hair so the good beach um my friend actually one of my other friends suggested it and then they ended up not going they went to landmark and i went to landmark last year and it's nice um i didn't really get to like enjoy it though because i came late when I thought I came late, it was just, oh my gosh, it is too hot. Let me put this fan on. It doesn't affect the quality. Okay, I'm putting it on low. Ooh, child. Yes. So, I didn't really get to enjoy Landmark last time because that traffic, it is like, it chokes up. That Landmark area is like work. It's the worst place to get a boat, request a boat, have a boat drop you off. Because it's just, it's a mess, okay? Uh, especially during festive period. It's a mess. But yeah. Mm, I did my lip a little too pink. I want a little more brown. Because I want like a little natural. But yeah, I'm just quickly trying to like, hurry up, get ready. Let me show you guys a little quick OOTD. So I'm wearing this black, long, super long dress i'll show you guys probably when i get to the beach because i want to make it before sunset yeah yesterday was super fun today is a beach day a last minute beach day so i'm rushing as per usual but yeah let me catch you guys when i'm like on my way to my boat because i gotta hurry up <laughs> and get out of here before lagos traffic holds me up and we will arrive at night on the way to the beach. I'm sweating out. <laughs> but it's not far from the hotel. It's literally seven minutes. So I should be there in no time. And there's no traffic. Well, they're not jinxed. Ladies and gentlemen. Now the good beach is truly a good beach. This place is such a vibe. Like if it's not because of copyright, I wish you guys could hear the music play right now. The music is just ginger in me. You definitely have to add this to your list when you get to Lagos. Right, arrived at Good Beach. Hey, Paul. Hey. All I was in a swimming pool. Yeah. Like for a long time. I just want to see the beach, but the beach is like it's okay. It's cabanas and everything, but the swimming pool seems like where it's at. So we're about to go back to the swimming pool. Yeah. And this is Ola's cousin, Richard. Hi, guys. <laughs> yeah. So, oh, and then she told me to check out this spot in the middle. It has like Christmas trees. So I'm about to head there and show you guys what it looks like. They got food. You know, Nigeria beaches, there's always a lot of action. It's always a lot of action over here. So, yeah. You know, they have like separate like things over here. Separate? 
they have like separate sections where they have individual pools. Really? On this one. Is this beach big or is it like small? Huge. Oh, see. Those are what So like, let's say if you want to go to where everybody's at, those pools. Mm -hmm. Or if, let's say, you buy your own separate section. Oh, okay. Oh, this is... Wow, look at this. This is like separate sections for pools. There's pools inside of here. That's dope. Wow, look at this. That's dope. Yeah, that's dope. Piano times Yabi is like five on six. One thing about Lagos beaches is they do not miss. They will make sure you have fun. But if you do want the more relaxing vibes, there's also beaches for that too. We played Jenga, we danced, we ate. It was just vibes on vibes on vibes. Just got back from the beach. It was such a vibe. Those girls like that were playing Jenga with and everything, and the girls that were dancing, we, I, we just met them literally today. You would think that we've known ourselves because it was just so fun but yeah i'm about to order some food we're going out today's thursday everybody's in ghana i wanted to go to ghana so bad this year but i just don't want to rush ghana like i want to do ghana proper like i want to go to um i forgot the name of these um tourist attractions and all that but I want to I want to do Ghana proper like I was going to do a quick one two and like go for I'm not really a concert person anyway so I don't really care for the concerts but I want to experience Ghana the proper way but yeah sorry guys I'm Ghana so my friends left already but um yeah the beach was fun the good beach was definitely a vibe I don't know if I really did a good old TD earlier because I was rushing out but my little cute dress and it has pockets and it's like it was cute but yeah so i'm about to shower get ready to go out tonight i low-key feel like changing my wig completely and just being a brand new person but i do love this wig i love this hair but i kind of want to change up a little bit maybe but yeah, I got a shower because I was in a sand. I sweated out. My lashes popped out my eyes. I might wear shades. I don't know. I might keep this on depending on how I feel. But I'm about to order my food, call some room service, eat a little bit so I can have energy to get ready for tonight. So yeah, I'll catch you guys when we're about to like, you know, get ready for tonight. I got some food, some pesky pasta, because, you know, I'm a grilled chicken. Sometimes you get tired of the rice. And the, you know, swallow, and all that. Let's see how it tastes. All right, I showered, I ate, rejuvenated myself, and then we went off to library, which is a new club in Lagos. It's my top five, probably even like my top three favorite spots to go to. The concept of it is like, they got it. You're literally partying in a library. Guys, 
the stuff. We woke, we were supposed to leave this house at 10 30, but it's now heading towards one. <laughs> Every time I get on here, it's like I, we always have a time prediction. But, but, anyways, we, whatever. We went out last night. No, library was late. We went to library and it was like. I like the whole concept. Yeah, I love it. And I was telling that so much. You saw the menu? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It looks like a book. And the, the DJ booth was like in a shelf. In a shelf. Yeah, it was like in a. By the way, I'm losing what? my voice, you guys. Yeah, that was dope. Yeah, you guys had to hit up library. It was a dope little spot. And they had a confetti's. And you were like, oh, mm-hmm. if they're doing this now, what are they going to do for New Year's? Yeah. The confetti's was dope. But yeah, we about to go to um, Eli Shea. Okay. Oh, yeah, Wizkid was there. Wizkid was there the night that. Oh, yes, last night. We about to go to Eli Shea, right? Yeah, Eli Shea. Eli Shea Beach. Um, we gotta go to the jetties to get the speedboat to go to the beach. We running late, but yeah. Alright, bye guys. Our boat, our boat was ready. Oh yeah, you guys That's gotta easy. say hi. Yeah, oh let's hear about hello, all black. And I think Osay is changing up, but yeah, I'll catch you. Yeah, she look, you know, baddie as usual. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hello. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna leave my camera in the house. Catch you guys later. So. Already sweated out because we went to the wrong jetty. Now we're going to HOV, the entrance. part of the same building HOV it's like they have the the speed boats a bar and I think they have a, a barbershop downstairs because that sounds super cute I'm gonna see if I get a drink while we wait because it might be a long wait because he said like 30 minutes about like 20 minutes ago and it's not looking like much progress <laughs> yeah this is like um really cute so I'm about to get a drink I'm trying to wait for someone to me. Hi, good afternoon. Are you guys open? Oh, you guys just open? Can I see the Take it to you, make it. I understand what they mean. <laughs> I was terrified. The waves are so high. I'm just so happy we're pulling up <laughs> to our destination. <laughs> when Osai was like, Oh, yeah, he has to drive fast because the waves. I just said, mm-hmm. <laughs> like, Whatever we, way we're going to get there safe, let's get there. Whew. Thank God we made it. So now we got to take a car to the beach house. We just got off the boat. Ilache private beach is really nice. I would recommend you to go check it out. It's a private beach and basically you can rent a house and it's purely for enjoyment, fun, and catching cruise. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? We're back from Ileche Beach. It was a vibe. The beach was a vibe, but the speedboat was so scary. I was literally like holding on to dear life on that speedboat. But um, it was definitely good. We're about to head out. It's the last Friday of the year. <laughs> oh my God, it's the last Friday of the year. We're about to head out. I got on this like purple nice little dress or whatever. Oh, I changed my wig up. 
Because this wig, I want to wear this wig, but it's just too much to lay down. Like, and most of the time, it's just like, go, go, go. So the other wig is perfect for this. But I was like, let me change my wig tonight. I might even wear it tomorrow. Who knows? And Osei has her bomb. She got her snake skin. She got her boots. Like, she never disappoints. Look at her. She never, ever disappoints. Hey, like, she said we should call you guys Yabian. Yabian! <laughs> I think I might consider that, but yes. We about to head out. We requested our boat. It's like three. Probably, it's probably even arriving. Because you know how they say like four minutes? And then it says, I've arrived. And all oh, these boats, they try to be tricky. They try to make sure they don't call you. So that way your wait fee could be not waived anymore. And then they charge you. Gosh. Basically double the price. So beware of that. Because <laughs> they do that a lot over here. But yeah, we're just going to head down. Ola's not with us today. Or, I know it's it's not the three amigos, but today we got a casa amigo stolen. Oh my gosh! I wish she was here to tell that story. <laughs> Imagine like you go to an event and they tell you like you know feel free to bring what you want to bring, but yet like they felt entitled to our casa amigos basically like. <laughs> They <laughs> stuck it out the bag while we were in the pool and literally started just like they, they, they took it out. Away. Oh, so I'm in the way. All right, I'm gonna put my shoes on and head out. All right, bye guys. Bye, Yabian. Yeah, I like that name, Yabian. <laughs> Soya was a vibe. If you're not a crazy fan of big crowded clubs, I remember last December when I went to Zoya, they do have another section that's smaller on the other side of the club. But tonight was a fun night. <laughs> I finally get to talk to you guys after coming back from the curb. I got some shawarma as per usual. I got me some shawarma, okay? That's like the go-to whenever you come out, come back from the night out. I probably look crazy right now. I hope this is just chicken. By the way, I washed my hands like a few minutes ago. Please, I hope it's not sausage. I don't like when I put the sausage in the shawarma. For those of you guys that don't know what shawarma is, it's just kind of like a like a wrap. It's kind of like a wrap. That's a wrap. Mm. Cut the cameras. Good night. Happy New Year's, guys. Welcome to 2023. We made it to the new year. <laughs> my voice is completely gone. I understand why I lose my voice every time I go out now. It's because I literally scream the lyrics. I'll be standing on the couch. I'll be like, Oh, my life. Oh, my No one comes to me. No one comes to me. No one comes to me. I'm a mess, okay? But Happy New Year. It's a new year. I pray that this year is just a blessing for a year for us. Everything will be in our favor. May the best of our past be the worst of our future. In Jesus' name, amen. Yesterday, I honestly just stayed in. I didn't go out. I was just exhausted. One thing I know is that you can never, ever cheat your body, okay? I know it's like, no sleep, wake up, but 
I had to sleep. One thing I could say, Nigeria, like Nigeria, nobody can top their clubs, lounges, like not just like the nightlife in Nigeria, if you never experienced it, even if you're not a going out person, like a night out, I would say just experience it once because like, where do you see the interior design? They put a lot of emphasis in their interior for clubs, the outdoor design, the lights, the, like you feel like you're in a movie scene. <laughs> You feel like you're in a movie scene, honestly. But anywho, yeah, I'm just waiting for the rest of the girls. And then we're going to head on out. Oof. Sorry, guys. I like my hair to be flat, flat. Like, this wax. Like, I will hot comb it and I make sure it's flat, flat, flat. There should be, like, a reward for requesting boats in Lagos, Nigeria. All drivers are busy now. It will just keep connecting you and connecting you. You just have to keep waiting. Like, the patience that you have to have in this Lagos to request them. You know what? Ooh, I think it's connecting to a driver. I need a driver. I'm tired of boats. I need a driver. Like, that's what I need. Because... And then, you know the thing that makes me upset? Every time. Oh, where are you going? If you're going too far for them, oh, I got a driver. Look at me talking and now I'm happy. But still, if you're going too far, driver has arrived. This guy's funny. Ride canceled. These people are so funny. Like, so funny. Uh, now boat cars are busy now. What, like... You have to have patience in this. Like, you need to start requesting your boats when you're, like, halfway through with your hair or something. Because this is just insane. Ah! I'm trying to connect again to a driver. And I know there's a concert at Echo, Echo Hotel. So, let's cross our fingers. Because I'm not far from Echo. Echo. I keep saying echo, but it's echo. <laughs> uh, looking for another driver, you know what? That's fine. I'm just gonna wait till it works its magic. But yeah, I'm about to link up with the girls. I need to show you guys my outfit. <laughs> Cause like, I don't know. Let me show you guys a little bit. Cause it has a little, little spillage and it's really, really short. Oh, I think I just turned my phone around. Because these drivers, they'll say arrived and they'll start, the your late fee will be, um, your waiting fee won't be waived. Oh, drivers are busy. My area, this hotel area is like a lot of action going on. There's like concerts and just different things. So this is just going to be, I should have started requesting since. Because this is going to be a mess. A hot mess. I already feel it. But I'll catch you guys when I get in the car because I'm going to be waiting. I had to get like an end driver because both of them are just not working. Man, I'm in the car. I had to download this app called um, End Driver because both right now, they're just a mess. <laughs> so now I have two different apps. To request, I need a driver. Like, I should get a driver. Like, point blank, period. Need to get a driver. Shades. In case, you know. casual spot to check out. The bus, getting food right after the club. Mm, right outside. 
but they don't have shawarma. Hangover bears, hangover jewel. Just trying to count 4,000. One, two, three. You get it for now. No, no, no. You still get it in that or you're going to get it in the Probably I'm going to swallow my spit and sleep. I'm not serious. I'm not swallow your spit and sleep. I mean, I look on this live and I'm so far. If I pull up on the t shirt, you can hear him for a favorite word. If I pull up on the t shirt, ah, who don't like it? Join me. If I didn't name a bucket, hey! Let me know that you don't fuck it. Oh, you already got the food. Yeah, it was fast. I asked him how fast it was. It's 4,000, right? All I have remaining is. I literally only have 200 last year, so that's out of tea. I'm ready. I thought you were about to pass to somebody else. I'm about to you. What are you waiting for? Bye, guys. Who are you? What's going on? Oh, my hotel's right here. Here today, just took my hair out. Felt these braids. Or wash. And got my pan and yam with bokbono soup, my favorite. Oops, I haven't ate all day. So, I'm gonna miss them too. I'm gonna eat now. I'm gonna eat as I do my hair. I always like doing my hair in the house, in the comfort of my own home. So, you know, I'm able to eat, chill, relax. And I love when a pandemic is slapped on like this. Oof. Yes, I'm excited. You guys, funny enough, I don't eat with, uh, I don't eat with fork, but this time I'm going to because only because of my nails, that's it. But yeah, Bani Yam Nogbono is my favorite food in this entire world, like, past anything else. But yeah, I'm getting my hair done, my usual signature gray braids. So. Mm. Wow. Wow. Mm. Wow, wow, wow. And then I'm being blessed on such a Wow. Trust me, guys, I'm a very bush girl. Like, I'll eat with my fingers, but. This. When I say it, I don't think you guys understand how much I love Panayam, but of bonus. Mm -hmm. Just while I eat, and then we'll go back. Ah, my you house is foul. Your house is foul. And my area is yeah, foul. I can't go out to No, I'm just saying, just inside, I eat, and then I'd, I'll just wrap it with the hair over there. No, I'm saying, you can you can do it as I'm eating. No, you can do it as I'm eating. Yeah, I'm saying, I'll go back to that area when I'm done eating. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. I'm not going to have finished eating before I... I do this thing. You live in Aja, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm getting my signature gray long braids because this is officially my signature look. Hey guys, I finally finished my hair. It's a forever. Guess who I'm with? Carol Kings. Nice. This is my London babes. So yeah, this is like becoming my signature hairstyle. By the way, our driver is outside. So quit. Oh, we're in black today. Okay. <laughs> we're both wearing all black today. So yeah. About to head out. Must be really fun. Yeah, it's just me and her tonight. It's gonna be lit. Alright, we gotta go because our driver. Toodles. <laughs> this night was so fun. We didn't even plan to go out. I had just got my hair done and girls, you know when you get your hair done, you just want to be outside, you want to go out, you want to get dressed up and cute. I went with my UK babes, my girl Pearl, 
it was a spare of the moment she just hit me up and she was like babes let's go out and when i say the best nights are unplanned so anyway, you see, don't get my to tell them, say, when I make a make a way. This is my favorite Nigerian song of all time, okay? This night was a zoo. See you right tonight. Hey, right now, I want to say happy new year to everybody up in this like way. And right about now, I got DJ on the spirit of DJ and Zan right now. DJ, go fuck this to go right now. Yeah, we started off. We went to what? what a bus bar? Bus first? bar, yeah. Then we ended up in Quilux. And we leave in Quilux at almost 9 a.m. in the morning. What the f? <laughs> Your accent is so funny. Because I don't take you guys serious when you guys like. Me too. I don't like, take you guys serious. I would No, you don't take us serious when we like. Of course. We, we swear. Well, I think I'm just going to eat breakfast at the hotel because you know I keep missing breakfast. And Maybe I, you don't have it. Like, I had it one time, it was actually really good. So, I want to eat everything. I just take it in the morning. Because I know I won't. Come I usually back. come in in the morning. So, I end up just eating what I get home. But, yeah, guys. Oh, my, I requested a bowl and I forgot to cancel the ride. Now he's saying hello. Hello. Uh, hello. <laughs> Is that Quilux? I don't want to get blocked off a boat because I keep can't, if I keep canceling rides. Well, right now you're like, I completely forgot that I requested. You know what you do now? You come and tell me left. You're sorry. Oh uh, my god! I hope I don't get blocked for the day. Hey y'all! Oh my god! <clears throat> my voice is gone. Hey guys, Lagos has defeated me. Like, I might be a retired Desi December veteran. Because <laughs> last night, funny enough, <laughs> I'm laughing because I said I'm not going out tonight. Like, I'm not. But Pearl just texted me and she said that I have vertigo. So I was just like, you know what? I ate, I took a nice shower, I was gonna put my pajamas on, and I was like, you know what? Let me just go out. I'm even going out with no makeup. I'm just gonna put my shades on. All I got on is Bliss Text and Shea Butter. Nothing else. So that was me for today. I'm about to request my boat or my in drive and head out. Oh my god, last night. The reason why I didn't want to go out tonight is because last night made up for two nights. Two nights. <laughs> oh my god. Lagos is like, what is it like? 11 days now? Lagos is 11. Yabi negative zero. Oh my god. Oh, walk of shame from yesterday. Hey, but anyways, let me go because the time is like 3.30. So I gotta request my boat, meet up with my babes. We're gonna go to Vertigo and then we might go to the library. And library is such a vibe. This is the place I went last time. So yeah, we're gonna head on out and I'll catch you guys. Oh my god, my voice is gone. Embarrassing. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys later. to vertigo with my uk vibes pearl we just went on a casual ting you know vertigo is really nice you should check this spot out then later we went to the library <sighs> okay guys finally came home before sunrise which i'm so proud of myself <laughs> um yeah, we just had 
we went to, um, what did I say before? We went to Vertigo. And then we went to, we went to the, what's this thing called? The library. And yeah, we took, we got, you know, some drinks. You know, this on Dori, man. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm so happy I did not do my makeup. Oh my God. So that way I could just literally pop my glasses off and pop my contacts off and just go to sleep. Like, even I'm not going to sleep. Because it is 5.31. I left the house at 3 something. So I was only out for like two hours. So yay. Toodles to me. And I know you guys like the long vlogs like i think this should be like probably up to like an hour long i know you guys like my long travel vlogs that's why i'm like trying to record every little second that i've been here i've been doing pretty good even some parts i didn't record but you know for the most part i did a lot of nightlife and i did some day activities too but then sometimes like my storage is full so i didn't record for you guys but anywho i'm home and um tomorrow i don't have anything planned i do really want to get my nails done because i was supposed to get it done yesterday but i ended up what's that noise anyways um, i really want to get my nails done tomorrow so let's see how that goes but anywho i'm about to get on ready and sit on the bed make some phone calls and call it at night yeah. You guys, like, you guys have to come to Nigeria. Come, come. The points of my vlogs are to show you guys things to do, what to do when you're around in the city, in the country, city, whatever. That's the whole point to like be informative and just give you guys fun stuff to do. Like, you know, life enjoyment is fun is part of life, honestly. Like, you need to take vacations, you need to have fun because. When you work hard, you have to play harder, okay? Because you're basically dedicating eight hours in a day for the most part, five days a week, 40 hours a week to a job. And you need, like, you, you can't just dedicate a few hours to enjoy yourself. Like, you know, if you, if you prioritize your happiness, which I prioritize my happiness, I'm always going to find time to have fun. Like... That's my motto of life. Enjoy your life because your next okay will chop your money. <laughs> your next okay will chop your money. Like, imagine you work so hard. Don't get me wrong, generational wealth is amazing. That's what I'm building. But don't starve yourself and you don't even enjoy your money. Because while you're working hard for the money, sweat and tears are into what you're doing to make this money. Your next okay will be popping during me every, every weekend in the club. Your next okay will be. Uh, <laughs> have fun like life is not to be taken too serious have fun but um i might be a, a dirty december veteran retiree like i might retire because um unless i'm coming to nigeria to make money but because <laughs> yeah money was burned in this this december so i definitely want to like you know Oh, I don't know what I'm saying right now, you guys. Anywho, definitely enjoy your life because this life is no promise. The only thing that's promised is, you know, the day you go. So in between your birth and the day you are called home, enjoy yourself. Yeah, I got my clothes done. I have a sweet tooth, you guys. So this was definitely needed. I got the birthday cake remix as usual. Don't mind my nails. I'm gonna get them done. All right, heading out, guys. We got all black on. But I'll say you always wear. You always wear all black yeah. unintentionally, but personal. You like you. That's just your. Purposely. Oh, you purposely do it? I love black. Yeah, she literally wears it, like, all the time. I'm more of a color person, but since I have gray hair, I kind of got to tone it down. But yeah, we're about to head on out. Catch you guys later. Um... I never, never, like, I never know how to cross the Lagos Road. They're always, like, crazy. Come on, girl. Hey. hey. 
excuse you, but they just, they don't care. They hit you, they'll just say sorry. <laughs> okay. of velvet in tna that night i'm in my boat headed to get some norma because i want to get some suya and then go back to my hotel hey peeps what's up wagwan headed to um out to eat to this restaurant called slow i've been wanting to try it out so we're gonna check it out today got Back up for you guys. Whew. Got this cute little <laughs> red dress. I don't know if you guys can really see it well. It's a little cute dress that is ruched on the side. Super cute. And the smell of today is going to be some Chanel. Chanel. That's what I'm gonna be wearing. That's my son. But yeah, I already requested the boat. So just waiting for it to come. And I'll catch you guys. Excuse me. I'll catch you guys at the restaurant. I put my hair on like a little half up, half down look. So I'm doing a little something different today. And I feel like I sweat less when I have this on. Yeah, what head out? Okay, I just finished up eating at Slow. I'll probably give you guys my honest review when I get back to the hotel. Cause yeah, <laughs> Lagos restaurants are known for being the aesthetically pleasing vibe, but however, just not with the food. But I'll give you guys a, a little honest review when I get back. Hey peeps, so I'm back from Slow. And here's time for a review because <laughs> I got some takeaway. I didn't finish my lamb chops. But um, I've heard that Lagos restaurants are known for being aesthetically pleasing, but the food doesn't match up to par to the aesthetic. And me, I love an aesthetic restaurant, but I also want the food to be good. This is like a small takeaway. I had three lamb chops and they took it back to pack it for me. And I ate two. I ate two, but I didn't fully eat it. Like, I wanted to, like, suck the bone, like, at home. I didn't want to do it in public. So, I had them. I hope he didn't throw out. Yup, he did. And he didn't even pack my mashed potato. He literally just packed my lamb chop. This is why I like to pack my food by myself. Because I get it, like, all these upscale restaurants. They want to pack it for you. Let me go to the back and pack it. But 
my mashed potato, I still have mashed potato. I wanted to literally bag everything. Anywho, yeah, because I'm like, why is this so, <laughs> well, another point down. <laughs> I don't want to knock anybody's business, but look, my little opinion doesn't even matter. You guys should still try out slow, but slow, I would give it like a 5.5 out of 10. Um, the drinks are trash. <laughs> I got um, uh, rums. Drinks are not the best. Mm -mm. And they do this thing with like chili spice. I don't like it. Um, the food wasn't that great. The mashed potatoes look like bonded young. <laughs> that's just that's just honest. Um, it tasted okay. I did want to take my mashed potatoes with my lamb chop, but he didn't pack it. So I would have showed you guys because I don't know if I really showed a really good video of how it looked, but it was alright, it wasn't all that. Um, the aesthetic is nice. The okay, so I today's Sunday, so I went on a Sunday, and I guess like reservation was needed, so I had to sit at the bar because they didn't have a table. They put my name on the waiting list, but they said reservations are coming, and da -da 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 -da. so I didn't want to stress this. So I sat at the bar. Um, usually I never do that. I never go places without making a reservation because reasons like that, but whatever. Anywho, I would just give it a 5.5 .5 out of 10, but definitely try it. Um, it was either slow or RSVP, but I wanted to try slow because I saw like the aesthetic of it and I was like, oh, this is cute. But I think RSVP is more like vibes and it's more like good food. <laughs> um, because a lot of people say the food is amazing there, but at least I tried it, experienced it. It's really cute. They don't have African food, so it's more so like American dishes, lamb chops, lobster tail, um, you know, stuff like that, prawns and all that. But anywho, so Detsy December, hmm. So basically, we're gonna call it Detsy December and January, Jaya January. <laughs> because people are still outside, but I mean, obviously, calm down. Um, I pretty much just wanna have a like, chill, like outings, like restaurants, cute daytime activities you know lagos will always be lagos um but for now the nightlife i've done it i've been there done that we we came we saw we conquered now i just want to do like more daytime stuff activities just like chill stuff like just day in the life in lagos not like you know um don't get me wrong like you know i might still go out tonight but i just want to be more chill you know yesterday i went to a nice little lounge i don't think i vlogged yesterday but i went to like a uh, a casual lounge then I went to another lounge um in VI then I went to another lounge briefly and then I kind of just like came home and then I chilled by the pool by the hotel I don't think I showed you guys that but it's a little cute spot um by the hotel lobby um and then I slept pretty late so I kind of woke up late I wanted to come go to slow during the daytime but that didn't work out Anywho, I'm about to just uh, hit up my friends, see what they're doing, and just like have a casual night because I definitely don't want to stay in by myself. Hey y'all, I think the last time I saw you guys is when I went to Sailor's Lounge. It was not really like a lounge, it's just like a chill outdoorsy spot. Wait, actually I think I didn't record, I didn't vlog when I went to Sailor's, but Sailor's was the day I had the red dress on after I went to Slow Restaurant. Um, I came back to the hotel and then I went to Sailor's, which is in Lecky. It's like a little chill, outdoorsy spot on top of the water. It was actually pretty cool. I'm trying to do my edges right now because I'm about to head to Rufus and B. My friends, they're already there. So I just took a shower, honestly. Guys, I've been sleeping. Yesterday, I needed to rest because since New Year's Day, I haven't had a day of rest. So yesterday was my rest day, so I felt a little rejuvenated. Um, so we're about to head on out to Rufus and B. And Rufus and B is like an arcade, and they have like bowling, so we're going to go bowling. So I'm wearing just like simple clothes, comfy clothes, because, you know, <laughs> I could be a little competitive when it comes to stuff like this because, you know, I'm always going to be the champion, okay? So, yeah. 
I'm about to head there. It closes in like an hour. So honestly, I might go somewhere after just like to chill since I'm already out the house. And yeah, I'll see. Maybe I'll record some clips I wrote for some because it's pretty cool. It's pretty fun. Like if you're in Lagos, I say you try it. It's it's good to go with friends, family, like a group of people. But yeah, let's head on out. Yeah, where exactly are you, Chris? I'm in VI. I'm at VCP Hotel, Victoria Crown Plaza. Okay, okay, I'm coming. Okay, I'll be waiting. They just be calling you. Where, I'm surprised you didn't ask where I'm going. Because sometimes when you say where you're going, if they don't want to go there, they'll just cancel. Let me even text it to him. Victoria Crown. Funny, funny enough, I don't have shoes. I don't have, like, sneakers. So, I don't know how this is going to work. Because, I mean, they're going to give me bowling shoes, right? Because we're probably going to go bowling. Hmm. About to pick some behind in basketball. Rufus and B is a nice spot to go with family on a date night or go out with your friends. I love activity outings, so this was definitely fun. Of course, I'm the one winning all the games. I won the basketball and the ice hockey. Because I'm a Which one are you? That's how you don't like Are you solid or striped? Which one are you? Solid. Clearly solid because there's only one stripe. Ooh. <laughs> she trying to play you. <laughs> I'm sorry. You I don't even think he caught what she I said. Don't know what they said yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Know what she said, but what do I do? Oh yeah, yeah. You know what he said? He said, he said, he said, I know what she said, but what do I do? Like, and he made it right. Made it. Mm, prove your, prove your claim. Like that. Like that.